Namaste teachers. In this video, I will show you how you can create a meeting in Google Meet and how you can attach that scheduled meeting in ERP. So let's get started. And here I'm covering only how to do this in laptop or a computer. But in the next video, I will show you how you can do this in a mobile. So teachers, before scheduling your meeting in ERP, you have to schedule your meeting or create a link that you are going to copy in the ERP so that uh, students can join your meeting through that link. So first create that link in Google Meet. So for that we have to open up our Google Meet and uh, teachers please do download your Google Chrome browser because this Google Meet application works best in the Chrome web browser. So here is the my browser window and uh, here link on click on this uh, application Google Apps this button here and uh, click on this meet button this is the Google Meet application which you can directly use from the Google Chrome itself. Click on it. So here, this is the interface for Google Meet and which is pretty simple. You can start a meeting or join a meeting, just enter the code here. So you can start your meeting right away, just clicking on this button here. But the thing, the problem here, starting a meeting directly from this button, it will create a link every time you start that meeting. So always, whenever you start a meeting, the link will be different. So to use a unique link, you have to schedule your video meeting from Google Calendar. So you have to use this button here. So I'm clicking on this button. So this is pretty simple. All you have to do is to provide the title. So I'm providing a title here. Meeting regarding Google Meet and ERP. So next one is your date and time. So I'm scheduling this at 3 p.m. So 3 p.m. to 1600 means uh, 3 p.m. to 4 p.m. and after that uh, here you can see the join with Google Meet and uh, your link that uh, you have to copy this into the ERP. So I'm copying it and uh, and pasting it some somewhere safe where we can use this later on because uh, you have to provide this link into your ERP so I'm saving it in the notepad and other settings like email 30 minutes all the settings are pretty simple and here teachers do check again that your email will be the same that you have synced with the ERP so mine is uh, this one so I use this email while I was syncing with the ERP so make sure that you use the same email ID and after that just click on save button and uh, your meeting will be scheduled in the Google Calendar. Now open up your ERP. So I'm using, opening up my ERP through the school's website. So just click on this login button. So this is the window for uh, ERP. Just uh, input your user ID and password and click on login button. Now just click on this uh, teacher's dashboard that I have covered in the last video, how you can sync your Gmail account with uh, this ERP. So just click on teacher dashboard. And uh, from this navigation pane on the left, click on this e-connect, not e-content. You have to click on this e-connect -con button here. And here you have to add your meeting schedule, the details regarding your meeting. So click on this add button. So this window will open up when you click on this add button. Here you can see the academic year. Next is meeting for. So I'm selecting teachers uh, because we are scheduling a meeting at 3 p.m. today, 21st of June regarding this Google Meet. And next one is department. So I am selecting only teaching. So you can uh, select as many as department you like. So I'm selecting all the teachers with their respective codes. So just select that, select all the teachers just by pressing shift and arrow keys. After that, topic of the meeting. Uh, I am writing meeting about, again I am writing here, Google Meet and how to use. So you can add description if you want. So here this is very important, just uh, write the URL we just save in our notepad. So you can save it anywhere you want. I am just copying it and uh, pasting here. So here uh, meeting date is 21st, starting time will be our 1300. Sorry, 1500, so 1500 to 1600, one hour. So it is pretty easy, just select the meeting date, start time and end time. After doing all the settings and selected all the employees or students, just click on save and you will receive a notification that uh, this meeting has been scheduled by this employee. So you can directly join this meeting from my uh, given link here. 
that is all for now how to schedule meeting and attach link in the ERP now whenever a student login student login in ERP he or she will automatically know about your meeting and you can directly join through the Google Meet link that you have provided here now in the next video I will show you how to schedule and join the link in mobile app so stay tuned in and thanks for watching this video